Too much bear. Jersey, <laughs> Jersey, 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 I was just uh, I was like, yo, what are my little cousins doing? You know, my like, little cousin, you saw my before, he's 18 years old at the time, you know, six months ago. Went on his Facebook, clicked on this link. Like, a Ustream was like a live YouTube. Like, I don't know what the fuck a Ustream was, but I was like, I got nothing else better to do. Clicked on it, bang. Saw him in Penn State, you know, in front of the you know, same exact thing in Penn State in a dorm room. You know, talking to 20, 30 kids, like, yo, I'm 18 years old. I own my own business, make $1,000 a month. So I'm like, oh, this motherfucker made more money than me. You know what I mean? I was like, what the fuck is he doing that I'm not? You get what I'm saying? Obviously, he piqued my interest. So I was like, hit him up after, was like, yo, cuz, you know, what's good, you know, you're going to tell me shit, you see the chain, you know what I mean? Bro, what up, cuz, what was that thing you were talking about? What was that chain you were talking about? You know what I mean? He was like, what, I was like, what was that thing you were talking about? And they told me about the verb, the demon, the whole thing. And I was like, I don't know, bro, that sounds a little sketchy. Like, I want to do some research on it, you know what I mean? So literally for three days straight, man, I dissected the company, you know, the can, the verb, the demon. And then I was like, bang, holy shit, man, this shit's real. Like, no way. So right there, I knew, I didn't know what I was gonna do, I didn't know what I was getting myself into, but I knew where this company was going, I knew I had to be a part of it, it was that simple. Uh, they didn't mention before, but the can's only been out for 40 years, guys. The first three years, it comes from Scottsdale, Arizona, for the first three years, it was on the West Coast. So basically, kids, you know, were trying to figure out the game plan, how this thing worked, you know, trying, trying to get together, you know, how to make it work, fell on their face, got up, fell on their face, got up, you know, learning this and that, finally got the game plan down, and that fourth year that just passed, where I'm from, New Jersey, they got to the East Coast, and I'm like, yo, guys, do this, this, and this, and you're gonna get results. So they were like, all right, definitely listen to them, and then it's blowing up all over the East Coast. You know, I went back to New Jersey, and I was like, holy shit, those shit's on another level, I'm out here, you know what I mean? It's like, so it was blowing up on the West Coast, blowing up on the East Coast, I'm out here in New Orleans, like, all right, bro, if it's, you know, blowing up there, blowing up, I'm out here, obviously I'm gonna do this before someone else does. You get what I'm saying? I was like, I wanna be that motherfucker who started this bitch, you know what I mean? I was like, I'm, I'm gonna be that guy, I'm not gonna wait on someone else, so I'm gonna make this thing happen, you know, all by myself. And that's what happened, guys. I took it serious, and I, like you said, dude, if I would've never done this, no one, no one of you guys would be here. Like, one kid made one decision, took me down a road I never even thought I'd be down. I'm fucking driving a BMW. It's like, holy shit, dude. It's like, I'm living this life, you know what I mean? Like, it's crazy. And that's the thing, I'm, I'm the first kid in my family to own a BMW. Like, I can legitimately say, you know, mommy and daddy didn't buy my car, I, I earned it. You know what I'm saying? Because I wanted it. And that's the thing, you know, why I do this thing is very powerful to me, because I know it's gonna change my life and help out all my homies change their life. You know, but where I come from, I don't have a lot of money. Just I'm wearing, you know, the gold chain. You know, these guys go, oh, the kids don't have money. You know, my dad gave me this, my brother gave me this. It was only, you know, $200 watch. It was good, though, you know what I mean? But <laughs> <laughs> I, really, I really don't have money, but through this company and where it's going, I know I can legitimately be a, be a millionaire. You know what I mean? Like, I already know where this thing is going. You know, I, you know, when I talk to kids on campus, I was like, dude, I'm going to be getting a BMW and all this shit. I'm making a lot of money. Kids are like, bro, you're, you're crazy. Bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're getting a car, you know what I mean? I was like, no, fuck you, I don't need you. All right, you can hate on me all you want, you just fuel on my fire, you get what I'm saying? So when I pull up in the fall, I'm like, oh, it's good. Oh yeah, it, it, no, this shit was real. Yeah, that shit was real, you know what I mean? I was like, like that Bema thing was real? I was like, yeah, asshole, thanks for nice fueling my fire, you know what I mean? So that's it, and I was like, dude, I'm gonna make this thing happen, and I'm very excited about it. But yeah, like I said, you know, my family, you know, both, both my parents bust their ass to put me through college, you know, and, and like I said, I don't have a lot of money, but in return, when I get out of college, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna have a guaranteed job. You know, 50% of kids that graduated last year were either unemployed or unemployed. I mean, they come out of college, say everyone here was in college, half the room graduated, half of you guys won't even have a job. Like, it's messed up, you know what I mean? Like, the, we, we take out loans to go to school, you know, we come out of school, there's no job, and then on top of that, we're racking up debt, bro. That's, that's a pyramid here in my eyes alone, you know what I'm saying? So I, I saw this as a, as a business I can do on the side, working with my homies, these are all my boys now, you guys hang out with each other all the time. Like, I already see, like, this is your clique, you know what I mean? Dude, why not build a business with each other? You know what I'm saying? Like, I know you've seen Entourage or some crazy ass shows. You're watching those music videos. Little Wayne and fucking everyone at the party in the club fucking killing it. You guys, like, yo, we're gonna, we're gonna be doing that shit soon. But, like, but what are you doing to get there? You get what I'm saying? Like, what are you really doing to, to, to ball that hard? You get what I'm saying? So I saw this as the vehicle for me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be in the club soon with VIP with all the homies straight kicking it. You know what I mean? Like, dude, we did this. We finally made it. You know what I mean? This is the vehicle that's gonna take me to, to do whatever I wanna do. What I go to school for is how to run hotels and restaurants at UNO. But you know, in the real world, if I never did Verve or Vima, you know, I'd probably come out of college working at a restaurant, you know, a lower, lower management, you know, do at a restaurant, working crazy hours. The restaurant business has, has crazy hours. I'd probably make it 30, 40, 50 grand, dude. That's not a lot of money, that's nothing, okay? So on top of that, I'd probably have to work 10, 15 years just to work my way up, get enough capital on the side to open up my own restaurants. But here, through Vima, this is my vehicle. Like you said, I'm not trying to sell you juice. I'm not like, all right, let's go hustle some cans. No, dude, we're hustling the opportunity. All right, so through this can, in three years from now, dude, I'm gonna have five restaurants already opened up, straight balling, you know what I mean? Why am I waiting? Dude, I'm building capital right here with this. It's an asset that'll pay you forever. 
It's a blessing. Like you said, dude, young people, we're looking for this thing, guys. And I mean, dude, we're, we're looking for the way out. We finally found the loophole in the system where we were like, dude, fuck working for the man. You know what I mean? I'm the man now. You want to work? You don't work for me now. You know what I'm saying? Like, dude, and that's how it goes. It, it really is a blessing. You know, I don't have a boss. I don't work hours. You know, I work when I want to work. I work with who I want to work. I mean, it, it's great. I, I wake up every day blessed. I drive a $50,000 car now. Like, he, he wasn't joking, bro. I was driving a bicycle at class six months ago. I couldn't even pick up a chick. I was like, fuck, dude. You know what I mean? Like, can't do shit with that. And now I'm gonna call that lady. He's like, "Hey, what's good?" I'm, like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, go for a ride. <laughs> I'm living the life now. You know, I'm just an average ass kid, and there's nothing special about me, guys. I'm just like everyone else in this room. But if you guys have ambition, you guys have drive, you really want change in your life, like, dude, this is this is it. And, and we're here to help you. You can honestly see. You know, I just met Jordan yesterday at our other event. And I talked to him, dude. He's, he's a great kid, straight up. And this is your homie. You know what I mean? Obviously, he's really looking after you guys. Cause he's gonna do this thing, you know, with or without you. No disrespect. If you don't do it, that's cool, guys. Hey, God bless you if you think. But understand, we're going to keep rocking and rolling. We're not stopping for no one. You know what I mean, dude? We're conquering. We're taking over this motherfucker. Exactly. And that's the thing. So he's, he sees what we see. If you guys see what he sees, bro, let's get on board. You know what I mean? You guys build your own squad. Rip shit up, dude. And I'm here to help you. You know what I'm saying? I'm just like your coach. That's it. I'm just calling the plays. You go you go fucking score a touchdown. That's it, dude. That's all we're doing. You know what I mean? We're running this bitch. But uh, yeah, obviously, I'm very excited. You guys can see this is what I do now, though. You know, I'm just, a, I'm just an average kid, bro. I'm just, if you guys, you know, if you, if you know people who are outgoing, people who like to make money, and people who have more ambitious, people who don't, who don't like their job now, you can help them get at it. You know what I mean? You guys, you know, you know how to hustle, whatever. Dude, we're, we are hustlers. We're just hustling an opportunity. You know what I mean? It's like, dude, my mouth is my business. Everywhere I go, I'm talking, dude. It's like, can you talk? You know how to talk? All right, where you can do the business now. Right, you know what I mean? Like, it's, that, it's that simple. If you can talk, bro, your mouth is your business. That's it. Like, even when, like, I have, I have two other jobs, too. You know, I work in a gym. I do a little, stuff, like, a little acting stuff on the side, whatever. But even when I'm working, I'm working. You get what I'm saying? Like, even when I'm working, I'm still working. You get what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm hustling on top of hustling, dude. It, it's awesome. So everywhere I go, I'm just stressing the opportunity. And that's the thing. There's so many people in this world. Like, dude, it's ridiculous. In this state, in this state alone, there's only about 100 kids out here. You know, I have about almost 250 kids in my networks. So I'm from New Jersey. I have a whole uh, people in Jersey too. But out here in this room, you're literally looking at the founding fathers of this state. Like it sounds like ridiculous, but dude, we are going to be the top dogs of this bitch. Guess that's all. I was like, I got to do this for someone else. Does it's that simple? I was like, dude, I know this thing is going. Now I got my homies. You know, now, now that's it. The army's already built. Now we're just conquering. Now we're just taking over. We're just going. You know, we're at like seven different colleges. I'm in like four different states. I'm in another country. All right, this thing is in 60 different countries. I'm a 22 year old kid. My homie that I live with is from uh, Africa. This thing is ready in four countries in Africa. It's in Ghana. So my boy, yeah, we got on a Skype call. You know, they couldn't do that 10 years ago. Our parents couldn't get on a computer and you know talk to someone in another country. And now my business is in another country. I'm a 22 year old kid. It's like, oh, where's your business? Oh, I'm in Africa too. And shit. You know what I mean? Like, like what? How old are you? You know what I mean? Like, it's it's happening, dude. It's crazy. All we're doing is networking, dude. We've been doing it our whole life. You know what I mean? We've been doing it our whole entire life. You know, when Ain came out, you're on the buddy list. I was in middle school, you know, creeping on the ladies, you know, let's go late at night, you know, hitting the AIM. Like you said, the social networks, they just get better, better, and better. So this is it, dude. It's like a social network where we're just getting paid for it, bro. Facebook was a product. It's that simple. So, um, let's give you guys an idea how this thing kind of works. <laughs> just to give you guys a little idea how this thing works, you know, if you guys all had a job, I'm pretty sure you guys are paid by the hour. You know, so say you get paid eight bucks an hour, you know, whatever it is, you can only make a maximum worth of pay of, you know, 24 times eight, 24 hours, you know, times $8 an hour. That's the most money you can make in one day. How this thing works is you know, I have, you know, 200, 250 people on my network. If those 250 people work one hour a day, I just work 250 hours in one day. You see how it works, dude? Eventually, yo, you, you take this thing serious for the next two, three, you know, two, three, four years. That's it. You never have to worry about money again. You plant your feet, you dig the roots, you build that network, okay? That hundreds turn into thousands. We blow up the state, it's going to turn into thousands, okay? And then those thousands of people are going to keep getting people, 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 and so on and so forth. It's a vicious cycle. That's why you do this thing now. You know what I mean? I'm living, I'm living the rest of my life free, dude. You know, I bust my ass for five and I live, I live the rest without no worries. Like, it's a blessing, man. I'm going to take care of my family. You know, I'm going to marry a hot ass wife. I, I, I don't want to be that guy, you know. I love football, man. I love balling. Time I met T. Jones, you know, my boy. But um, I don't want to be that kid, you know, when, I, when, I, when I, my son's got his first baseball game or a football game. He's like, yo, dad, you coming? He's like, no, I can't make it. I got work. You know what I mean? Fuck that shit. You know, I'm going to be there with a fucking big ass sign. He's like, yo, pizza on me after the game. You know what I mean? Like, we're doing this thing, dude. I, I, I'm, I'm just looking down the line. You know? I see where this company is going. Literally, you know, like you said, we made a, almost $120 million last year. Dude, we already doubled that. We're going to triple that this year. So in the next two, three years, it's gonna be a billion dollar industry, a billion dollar company. Okay, you get in this thing now, okay, and then it blows up and you were there before before no one knew about it. Yeah, bro, like you said, you're cashing out, but you're gonna be wealthy. 
Like, if I told you about Apple for the iPod count to buy stock in Apple, would you? Like, fucking right. You know what I mean? You'd be a millionaire. This is the same exact concept. It's just like I'm, I'm, I'm living stock of the company. I'm just making it happen. That's it. That's all. That's all. That's all we're doing here. But uh, yeah, if you guys want to get involved, you know, there's two ways to get involved. It's very simple. All you're doing is purchasing, purchasing product. So there's two ways to get in. The one way is you know 150 bucks. You get two cases of the verb. Then basically you just do what we do. You know, you try it out. You like it. You just tell the story, guys. All we do is tell the story. Top of that, second way to get in. Five hundred dollars sounds like a lot of money. All you're doing is you know buying more cases of the bourbon, 150 cans as opposed to you know uh, the 42. So with that comes with two incentives. Obviously, like you said, you know you, you can get the car. So as soon as you sign up with the 500, you're on you're on and qualified for the car. So it's like you sign up, bang, the car at the dealership, work your way up.